Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm bringing you three different hauls. We went to Costco, Aldi, and Meijer today. I mixed it all into one. I don't feel like separating it. Um, at Costco, we spent 118. We also got a large, just full-size whole pizza from there as well, which you won't really see. <laughs> um, and then at Aldi, I spent 95. And at Meijer, I spent 80. So I'm gonna show you guys those hauls and we're kind of getting back to normal grocery shopping. I'm starting to feel a lot better. I'll be 12 weeks Sunday when you guys see this and I got prescribed my third different medicine, Zofran. <laughs> so hopefully that kind of keeps me perked up here. Um, but I've been feeling a little bit better here the last few days. So that's definitely good. So I can start eating normal again <laughs> and shopping normal. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and Turn this around and show you guys everything we got. And then at the end, I will show you the meal plan. For the okay, so I'm gonna start over here. The sodas were three for 12 at Meyer, So I got three different. We can stock it in the back fridge in the garage. I got a watermelon from Meyer. It's gonna be kind of random. Um, I got some paper towels from Aldi, some diapers. And then that's the pizza we got. And from Costco, Justin got some swim trunks. Don't mind mountain of dishes. Uh, we got some cinnamon rolls, some applesauce pouches. We just really needed snacks mostly from Costco and dog food. Oh, we got a bag of dog food that's over there too. Um, got some fig bars, some Nutrigrain bars, some Pirate's Booty, and some Honey Nut Cheerios. And that was from Costco. And then the Meyer and Aldi is all just kind of mixed up together. We got some bananas. I had to get some more dish soap. We got some Honeycrisp apples. I got sweet onions from Meyer. I got two things of pasta sauce. I got some strawberry jelly, some sour cream. I got some broccoli. I got some baby carrots. And then I got four of these little um, pouches for Allie just to have in the fridge. And then I got two things of cream of chicken soup. And I get these pretty much every single time. But I got these little peanut butter crackers, two things of them. They're only like 70 cents, so my kids love them. I got some salad mix. I got a Caesar salad kit. My son loves Caesar salad now, so this is going to be for a side for a dinner. So I grabbed that. Back here, I grabbed a big old thing of spaghetti noodles because we are out. I got this breakfast bun coffee. Some Italian seasoned croutons for salads some bacon bits for salads, got some cubed ham for salads at Meyer. I don't know why, but this just looked really good and it was like 40 cents, the chocolate pudding. So I got one of those. I got some mozzarella cheese. I'm gonna cut this up so it'll kind of be like string cheese for Allie, but this is way cheaper. <laughs> so I just got this and I'll cut it up into little pieces. I got some cream cheese for bagels. My son requested Pop-Tarts, so I went ahead and grabbed these little off-brand toaster tarts for him. Um, just to have in the pantry, I got some brownie mix. I heard on the Aldi Isle of Shame Facebook page that these are supposed to be really good garlic knots. So I went ahead and grabbed those for our Alfredo night that we're gonna be having this week. And then I got some more paper plates. They've been helping a lot with the amount of dishes. And now that I'm starting to feel a little bit better, I probably won't really need to buy these anymore, but Whatever can cut down on dishes, I'm for. So I went ahead and grabbed those. Allie has just recently been obsessed with these things, these little mini muffins. They're great for the go. And if I am feeling really sick in the mornings for a breakfast with some fruit, something simple. Um, I got some of those corn squares in the back. And then back here, I got some orange juice, grape juice, olive oil, and then some apple juice. I got some meatballs, some raviolis. I got this uh, pork loin for dinner one night. And then Father's Day is coming up on Sunday. So happy Father's Day to all you fathers out there. Uh, we're gonna be doing steak and fresh corn and some sort of potato side for that day. So I went ahead and grabbed these. The strip steaks looked the best. The T-bone and strip steak were on sale and the T-bone didn't really look all that great. So grab those. Allie loves these little things. I know I've said it a million times in my hauls before. But I got the strawberry little Chobani probiotic pouches. They're just really convenient. And until she's not like a super messy <laughs> toddler, I'm just going to keep buying these. 
Uh, two things of Alfredo sauce. I'm not trying to be a champion here and make my Alfredo sauce this week. So just got two things of that. And then I've been watching, um, what's her name? Felicia, I think her name is. Um, she has a weight loss or just lost like 170 something pounds over the last couple years. And she always posts on Instagram and her Facebook, these little like chicken wraps. I think this is the chicken she uses for them. And it just looked really good. So I got this Tyson black and chicken breast strips for chicken wraps. Uh, sweet corn was on sale, five for two. So I went ahead and grabbed some of that for Father's Day. Grabbed a thing of white bread, a thing of bagels, a dozen eggs. And then of course the usual suspects, I got some blueberries and strawberries were on sale for like $1.70, I think. So I got two of those. And then some non-food items. I got Justin deodorant and Lucky Us. It was buy one, get one 50% off. So I got two of them. I got some glass cleaner. And then I was kind of surprised. Meyer didn't really have that great of a selection of multi-purpose sprays. And all they didn't either today. I don't know what was going on. So I just splurged a little bit and got the Method. Because Method is a lot more expensive than just like the generic. Like if I just need to clean something quick. I don't... That's why I don't really shop at Grove all that much anymore, just because I just, it's just kind of expensive. So I went ahead and just splurged and got that this time, but yeah. Anyway, and then last but not least, I got some Q-tips. And that is everything we got. And this, especially the Costco stuff, will last us a long time. So I probably won't do another big shop for another couple weeks, but next week I'll probably go back for like milk and fruit, but that's basically it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this week's haul. Kind of a bunch, we did a bunch of shopping today. It was much needed though. Like I said, I, we haven't really been shopping much like the last well, couple months since I found out I was pregnant because I've been so sick. So I've been like shopping here and there for like essentials, but definitely getting back into it. So thank you for your patience with these hauls. I still do have two hauls I combined um, from a couple weeks ago and I just never posted them because I was sick. <laughs> so, oh, cat and the dog. Um, so I will get back into that. I'll probably post that. If I don't do a big haul, probably next Sunday, just to like have a haul for that Sunday. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and, oh, I gotta show you guys my, uh, meal plan. Hang on one sec. Okay. So for the week, we're having meatloaf with mashed potatoes and glazed carrots. So for my glazed carrots, I just boil the carrots and then put honey and butter and like salt and pepper on them. Um, we're going to be doing grilled chicken Alfredo with those garlic knots. And we're just going to grill the chicken on the grill and then I'll make the noodles and the sauce or I have the sauce. And then we're going to be doing pork tenderloin or the pork loin with mac and cheese and broccoli. We're gonna be doing Ritz cracker casserole. We're gonna do that tonight actually, but I forgot the dang Ritz crackers and I need that for two recipes. So I have to go back because I need it for the meatloaf too. And then the last thing we're doing for the week is Father's Day and that's gonna be the steaks with corn and like loaded potatoes or fried potatoes or probably some sort of potato or rice or I don't know, whatever. And then for lunches, I'm gonna be doing chicken wraps, salads and leftovers. And that is everything we are doing for the next week. So yeah. Hopefully that gave you some ideas, <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.